just basically open this. The gas will come out. I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> you actually don't want it. You see some sparks because we had some residual iron from the last demonstration, from last class. Oh, yeah, don't get See if I can adjust it to make it. Can I try out the lights? Or wing marshmallow tomorrow? Yeah. Uh, I mean, not big enough. Okay, not, you don't have to put it just yet. Okay, so there's our flame. The hottest part of the flame is actually the blue part, not the yellow part. Because remember, blue has more energy than yellow. You remember that? Okay. All right, let's start with the iron. What I'm going to do right now is uh, take my iron, which is uh, in this little uh, jar, and put some on top of this, uh, this screen. Okay, are you recording? You can go ahead and record now. <laughs> so this right here is iron. Again, it looks like coffee. <laughs> Let's put it right here. Yeah. I'm actually not going to be touching the fire. Okay, so let's turn the lights off. And now I'm going to go ahead and uh, move this over the flame. Off. Now, let's see if that can make this work. Now you'll see, if you look underneath it, you'll see that it'll cause sparks, and that indicates that the iron is reacting with the air. If I can turn it up a little bit. It takes some time to heat up. I get cold? You see the sparks? No. Okay, look really closely underneath it, and you'll see sparks. No. I Lower a little bit more. It has to be in the blue part to get there. It's not going to explode, right? <laughs> You'll see sparks. If you look closely. If you want to come closer, you can. Just kind of look underneath and see sparks. Oh, yeah, I see it. You can kind of zoom in on the sparks. No, we see it. Okay. That is a reaction right there. I didn't want to see it. It's not very reactive, though, relative to magnesium. It's relatively unreactive. Yeah, let me show what happens if it is poured on the flame. Let me back this up real quick. So let's lower that flame a little bit. Okay, here's the iron. Just watch carefully. It's going to happen really quickly. We're just going to pour on here and see what happens. Are you ready for this? No. Really? See the sparks? Yeah. <laughs> oh, they're like like fireworks. That's iron. Yeah. Just a little bit more. <laughs> Watch carefully as I as I just pour it on there. We'll see. Okay, so that's it for iron. So we saw the iron was, it was reactive, but not really that reactive. So record those observations on your sheet. Write down that what you saw. It produced sparks a little bit, but not too much. Now we're going to try magnesium. Um, Jesus, bring me the magnesium, please. What did we write down? Uh, write what you observed. What did you see? Sparks. A little bit of sparks, not too much. Okay, now let's compare that with magnesium. Now, what do we know about iron? What kind of metal is that? What kind of metal is iron? Transition. transition. Are transition metals reactive? Yes. No, not as reactive. What about alkaline earth metals? Are they reactive? Yes. Yes. Okay, so watch this carefully. This is going to happen real fast. And in this case, I'm not going to wear the gloves. I'm not going to touch them. I'm going to hold it with the, uh, the tongs. Okay? Where are my tongs at? And notice that I will first burn it and then we'll spray it with water and notice the difference. Watch very carefully. Now they have to turn on the light. Okay, keep the lights off. This is magnesium, guys. We'll find out. Oh my god. Now watch what happens. When I spray it, <laughs> it causes it to actually get brighter. Why aren't you wearing gloves? Yeah. 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 Ye
Be careful, Mr. Up here. <laughs> Kill me. <laughs> You want to kill, trying to kill me here? Yeah, a little bit left here. Like that. Oh my gosh. Ah! Oh. Here we go, a little bit left. Let's do one more. Here you are, the other class. Your other class can use your imagination. Good. Last piece, guys. Here we go. Where's the spray thingy? You need the spray thingy. Now I want you guys to come over here and look at it. Look at what was produced. Turn the lights on. Look at the white powder. That's, mag that's magnesium oxide. It's white because of the oxygen. <laughs> See, it's all white on the side. Take some pictures of it too. I'm recording. That's the magnesium oxide I'm recording. Oh, it's white. Because of the oxygen it makes it white. Okay guys, let's get the doors, let's get some ventilation in here. Uh, You're done? I guess we're done, yeah. Go ahead and pack up, guys. I need some volunteers to stay after class. By the way, you need help today if you want extra credit. I need help organizing the lab. Put here to pause? Yeah.